July 25th. This here, when I saw this, this gave me the chills. I know there's been attacks on Christians, you know, with the clinic, people praying outside, pastors being arrested, their families, they're busting through the door for praying. Even had a young kid in Wisconsin, a young boy, teenager, praying, got arrested for praying across the street with the Bible, not saying one word, quiet, and they arrested him. This what happened in Wisconsin. But this here broke the camel's back. Remember, we had that meteor over New York City, and we had some strange lights today over New York City. This here is chapter 17, Revelation, and verse 6. This beautiful young lady, a mother and a wife of a young daughter, is sentenced to three years in federal prison for preaching the gospel of Jesus Christ in front of an abortion clinic. I know I'm going to get probably censored or kicked out. You know, Facebook just, I just got kicked out of, I just got banned in Facebook for I don't know what. Maybe because I warned the people about the early voting. That's the only video that I could think of. They're going to shut down people's voices. They already have, and they are, and they're going to continue to ramp it up. They'll start slowly with the people, with the people, ah, this is sad. And they talk about race, the hypocrites. They talk about freedom, democracy, and they're doing this. But yet in New York City, a police officer could get assaulted by illegal, and they get released within hours. We're talking assault on federal law, on law enforcement. And here... Here's a story released on a, yesterday from New York City, Southern District of New York. 41 months in prison. This, this is insane. This, my, okay, without thinking, I'm going to produce some predictions. That X-Class video that I just put out a little while ago in Yellowstone heating up. We got signs in the stars. Skies waiting on a Nova in the corona borealis which will be seen in the daytime people being voices being censored shadow banned we're living in the end times folks christians are being persecuted the followers of christ are being persecuted this is if you don't think the wrath of god is coming down look at look what's happening in africa right now snowing this here in New York City, these signs in the stars, the sky. Remember the meteor showers too, over the Statue of Liberty. These are signs. I see it clear as day. If this is my last video on YouTube, I'll be a rumble, beach boot, keep posting on X. I'm already been eliminated from Facebook and another site too. I don't want to say which one. It was because of the, it had to be the election, early voting video. Had to be. That's the only th last thing I posted over there. So it's on folks. It's on storms, earthquakes, especially where the headquarters of this censorship is happening. Yeah, I said it. This is it. The gates, the gates of hell is open. They talk about equality for black women. Well, all you black people, all you Latinos, Latinas, white people, Asian people, see this, promote this, spread the word. Don't let this young lady go to prison. You know it can happen in prison. I am really saddened. I am so sad. It breaks my heart. It breaks my heart because this vision, it's not a happy vision. God's not happy that X-14, our shields are weak. When that thing turns around facing us, this is the mystery of Babylon is going to get his dues. This is what I'm getting, the information. Enough is enough. I've had it. I've had it. By fire. Spread the word. Spread the word to your elected officials. Spread the word. Let others know. This is not right. This is evil evil pray for her pray for their families pray for the country pray for your family pray for your children